Today we're going to be unboxing this Toshiba Canvio Ready Hard Drive. It's an HDD and it's one terabyte. It's compatible with Windows 10 and Mac. So let's get started. All right, we're going to unbox it now. So pick it up. I already opened it. Pull it out. It's the box. But um, not sure if you can see this. Here's the compatibility stuff for it. So we'll put that over here. Your setup manual. And I think there's a warranty in here too. Right here it shows you like what it comes with. The hard drive and the cable. Here's the hard drive itself. I'm going to take it out of the bag. You can see it's Toshiba right there. And there's your cable port right there. Your model number and all that barcode crap are on the bottom, but I'm not going to show that. It's really tiny. Like, if we want to do a size comparison, depending on what you own, here's an Xbox controller, and here's the hard drive. You get the idea? If you don't game, well... Standard DVD case, even though it's a video game, all DVDs are kind of like that. See, about like that wide. And all that's left is this cable right here. USB and then this other thing, this part goes into your chart into the hard drive itself and this part plugs into your computer or xbox or whatever you're going to use it for i did not buy this for the xbox i bought this as a backup for my personal computer you see right here make sure they're aligned make sure this is aligned because two different ends are two different sizes and then you plug it in and you're ready to go I'm going to show you what it looks like now on Windows 10. Okay, since my uh, keyboard has a USB port right here, that's what we're going to be doing to plug in this Toshiba. So we got it right here. Got the cable. Plug it in. You see? Glowing blue. And then it should pop up on your Windows screen. You see right here, you got the warranty and stuff like that. So what we're going to do is I've made a sample Word document. I'm going to put it over here on my desktop Then go back. And then I'm going to put it here. Just drag and drop and that's it. And to, what's it called? And to disconnect, you just go down here. And you see where it says safely remove hardware, extended media. You're going to do that. And you're going to exit external USB. And then it's ready to be unplugged. If you don't do that, you can damage the files. So we're going to unplug it. One thing that you guys should get is one of these. This is old, but... This is a Pelican case. It's waterproof, it's airtight, and everything. They're really, feel like a brick. Open it up. This is where I put my flash drives, but it won't fit. It's too big. So what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna get a bigger one, one that's a little wider, and then put it in there, and then put in a fireproof safe, so it can be my PC's backup. That was all for this video. Thank you for watching.